Hi everyone, welcome to this video. My name is Brian from brightech.co.uk. In this video, I'm going to be telling you how to install the recovery console in your boot menu. Now, this is going to come in very handy if you've got your CD to hand. This will actually install the recovery console into the hard drive itself. So, when you boot up the PC, you'll get the option to boot into your uh, desktop or your computer or the actual recovery console, which is pretty handy. So I do this a lot for my customers, I put it on there just so they can actually go in and do a few things straight into the recovery console rather than actually keep putting the CD in and booting off the CD, it's much much quicker this way. So this is the command that we're going to be using, now you can actually get this command from Microsoft itself, so if you looked on the Microsoft website you can see how to install and use the recovery console in Windows XP, it's actually in, in the actual boot menu itself, so as you can see there's the command there, if you want to have a little look at that you can go to that website and basically read off that and there you go so I'm going to show you how to do it right now so basically all you have to do is go to the run bar like so paste that in there sorry not that just need to paste this in here or you can type in if you want but I don't need to type it in because mine's already done I'm just going to do it again just to show you so basically that's what we need to put in it'll be and the D the actual D for this is actually the CD so you will need to use your CD at this point as well because it wants to use the CD to take it off the CD so bear in mind the D is actually where my disk is okay so if yours is actually G or F or whatever it may be you change that letter to the drive where your CD is in, ok, it's that simple, click OK, it will then bring you up a prompt box to say you can install Windows Recovery CD at the startup option, say yes, it will then want to connect to Microsoft itself, like so, it's connecting to Microsoft, it's downloaded its software, update the software, uh, updating their setup and now it's going to install the, the stuff it needs off the CD at this point once this is done you will not need the CD okay so this is going to be pretty handy for people that have got want to do check disk and all that sort of stuff from the actual recovery console without putting all the CD in that's done I'm going to take the CD out of the drawer and just turn that out Obviously this is in a virtual machine, so it all looks slightly different. I'm going to reboot the machine now, so you can actually see what it looks like and how quick it loads. Let's just reboot that. You won't see this nag box, that's just because it's a virtual machine. Now you get the option here now, as you can see, it's in the boot menu. We've got the Windows XP Professional to boot into or the recovery console, so we're going to push recovery console and you'll see how quick it loads up and that's it and you just do the normal thing there you go, just put the one in there and from here you've got full control put your administrator password in if you've got one if you haven't push enter and then from here you can do what you like you can actually you know DIR do what you like check disk anything you like ok I hope this has been some use to you it's a handy little a little tool to put on your uh, startup menu my name is Brian from brightech.co.uk got any, any questions please uh, comment and I'll try and do my best to answer them please subscribe to my channel thanks very much for watching bye for now